Welcome back. A third round of stimulus checks already hitting some bank accounts. A survey from the website modernize.com says there's a good chance you may spend part of your stimulus money on fixing up your home. Brianna Richardson visited two furniture stores where they say they've already seen people fixing up the spaces where they've been spending a whole lot of time during the past year. The site surveyed more than 1,200 people about their plans for using the stimulus check, and nearly 60% said they'll use all or some of the money to fix up the house, which includes buying new furniture. Ashley Manska is expected to receive her third stimulus check this week, but she already used part of the last two rounds to buy new furniture. But Manska says finding a kitchen table was a struggle. We started um, back in November looking around, trying to find what we wanted, and the one set that we really wanted, um, they said it would be June or July before it came in. She says most stores had wait times between two and six months. Owner of Home Furniture and Mattress in Warner Robins says they've seen a big increase in demand for furniture. Supply and demand thing kind of started as a snowball effect from the beginning of the shutdown of, uh, pretty much exactly a year ago. Um, our, a lot of our factories were shut down for, for several, some of them several months. Um, that created a backlog in factory orders. Durham says quarantining, remote work, and virtual schooling likely explains the rise in business. He says you can save time if you buy something already in stock, but if you go custom, get ready to wait. If a customer wants to change the fabric or change the pillows or anything like that. Manager of Mobley Furniture in Perry is also seeing more business. Just people wanting stuff and wanting it now. It's just uh, they're ready to do it, they're ready to get it. Both Durham and Evans say they are doing what they can to get ready for the next rush. Now that the next round of stimulus checks is going out, we expect that to change a little bit. Uh, we're preparing our inventory, we're preparing our warehouses, uh, we're buying more, we're trying to keep more on hand for our customers. So that way when there is a demand and there is the, the rush of the um, immediate stimulus checks and things of that nature, that we can be here and be of service to people. In Houston County, Brianna Richardson, 13 WMAZ News. Some of the other big projects showing up on that home improvement survey include roofing and window projects.